Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're here to do the last two check-ins for March. Um, if you guys have been watching for a while, you know that I like to... Oh, I put that mark in the wrong spot entirely. Um, I like to finish my month at the end of the month and not the last week. Otherwise, this fifth week would go through April 4th and that just drives me a little bit nuts. So um, we're going to do a quick check-in for the week of the 22nd through the 28th and then for the 29th through the 31st. And that will be super easy because I don't have anything. So, um, I mean, I have a couple things, but all right. So we've got 83, 93. This is at zero. 149, 18 left. 143, 69. Okay, so for my weekly check-ins, right now I'm tracking fuel, groceries, miscellaneous, and unbudgeted. That will be changing in April, I believe. Yeah, I'm going to do the miscellaneous and eating out and not tracking um, the unbudgeted because I just, I don't have enough unbudgeted items to justify tracking it each week. Um, but with everything... The stores are kind of a mess right now and everything. Um, we've kind of been eating out a lot more than normal. And you'll see I do have one eating out transaction. And that is because that went on my card. Usually when I hit a drive through or eat out somewhere. I mean, I guess not somewhere right now because they're all closed. But um, I pay in cash with tips that I get from DoorDash or Grubhub. So I don't really count those in here because I don't count that income. So that's kind of how I'm doing that. But this one I did use my card for. And that wasn't even like eating out. That was just ice cream. So, But um, I do have two fuel transactions here. And I thought I had another one. Um, I'm filming this on the 31st. But I thought I had another one for yesterday. But I could be wrong. I don't have the receipt for it anymore but okay anyway so let's get into it I've got fuel is 1335 and 1376 is 2711 and so that leaves me 56 82 left and then groceries, I was over budget. I did not get any groceries for this week. So we're still definitely way over budget, which we normally are not, but um, I did do a big shopping trip where normally I would just grab a couple things instead. Um, nothing, nothing really else. So That'll be zero, and then unbudgeted is zero. And so this will be 149.18 left, and this is still zero. And so then we'll just bring this down. Okay. And so for these three days, I have no fuel and no groceries and no unbudgeted, so that's super simple. And then I, I don't know why I'm trying to grab the red pen. Um, I do have this, it's coded for the grocery, but it was household stuff and some stuff for Declan to keep him entertained while he is at home with my mom. And so that was a Target trip for $121.94. And I'm just gonna put that in the miscellaneous. And then, so 56, 82, 149, nothing on unbudgeted. And then we'll do 149, 18 minus 121, 94 is 27, 24. Okay, so that's looking real good, aside from the groceries. Um, we didn't go over anywhere except groceries. So, 
I'd say we did pretty good considering everything that's going on. But anyway, I just thought I'd throw both of those together since I knew this one was going to be really short. I didn't see the point in doing a whole separate video for it. So both of these together and you guys will see this on Wednesday, April 1st. And so my video tomorrow will be my review of how March went. So I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.